My name is Joe Sanchez. I am a lab technician here at the Royal Terrell Museum. Uh, my job is to prepare fossils. Uh, mostly the fossils I prepare are under the microscope, so I do a lot of the, the small mammal uh, fossils. And I also do a lot of the field work during the summer and the fall, uh, collecting and finding dinosaurs. For the Cenozoic project, I worked on making a lot of the small, smaller mounts uh, for specimens, um, ranging from something as small as an inch, uh, like the uh, Phenaco lemur, which is an archaic mammal, uh, to as large as a, a primitive camel, which is about the size of a dog, a, a medium-sized dog. So one of the specimens that I worked on for the Cenozoic project is this small artiodactyl dentary. And I made a brass mount for this specimen. We used, uh, I used three brass arms to hook on and wrap around the specimen to hold it in place. If we turn it around, see that they are all soldered on to a main brass plate. Um, and these all hook around those were all bent into place. Here, um, the main piece has a hook also soldered onto it. The specimen was for a hook onto the wall, so there will be a bracket, a separate piece that is drilled into the wall, and then this hook can slide into place. So this is Probotherium, which is a primitive camel. This was probably the most challenging specimen that I worked on. Uh, firstly, it's the largest mount that I've ever had to make with brass. Um, and the specimen was extremely fragile. Uh, so it was very difficult to, to work around that. Um, so for this one, it was mounted into the wall and into the ground. So we have three posts that connect to a main piece that goes along the backbone there. And then each leg also has uh, brass pieces that come up to help support the legs. And then the skull is a fully separate mount um, that goes into the wall as well, that kind of sits on top of the, kind of makes it look like it's sitting on top of the rest of the skeleton.